so you guys this is your girl lady t and i am coming at you with a rant like no other let me tell you a mess somebody somebody stole my cell phone yes me 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 my cell phone somebody stole my cell phone and i am livid about it okay it was what was it yesterday yesterday it was either i don't know I, it it still makes me mad thinking about it. i think it was friday either way i'm trying to do my thing get my exercise i'm going to go to the gym okay i have my cell phone in my protective case in my pocket it was safe secure and sound and somebody stole it okay apparently it fell out my pocket even though i don't know how it fell out my pocket between my house and my car Okay, but when I was going in my car, before I pulled off to go to my destination, I realized I didn't have my cell phone with me. So I was in the car looking for my cell phone because I thought it fell in the car. But apparently it had, it had fallen on the floor outside. And I had seen a neighbor go up the stairs that was this, I don't know, this guy. He was in this green coat. Yes, I know the guy. I've seen him before, but I couldn't see his face but I could tell it was the same guy I've seen thousands of times before I never really paid attention to that joker he bent down stayed there for a minute got back up and then walked up the stairs okay I thought that was peculiar at the time because I didn't realize my cell phone wasn't on my person and then all of a sudden I realized the cell phone wasn't in the car so I put one and one together that makes two two and two yes okay so i have come to the conclusion that somebody sorry y'all anyway like i was saying i'm sidetracked right now because i'm watching the grammys mm -hmm, and i just saw jennifer hudson i i liked her versace dress but the louis vuitton shoes were banging they were on point anyway I know it's been two days for me to get get over this situation and I'm still livid when I tell you I am living I am livid because I know for simple fact that it was I'm not saying that it was that guy hmm hmm but I know that it was somebody that lives in my building because it was it was less than 10 minutes and he was the only person that walked by when I was outside looking for my cell phone, I just didn't realize, I, I was in my car looking for my cell phone, I didn't realize that the cell phone had fallen outside. The thing about it is, is my mom saw his girlfriend the next day, and she had just casually, you know, casually asked um, the girl, oh, you know, I was wondering if um, your boyfriend or whatever had seen my daughter's cell phone she dropped it and she said that he was outside and she thought maybe he had seen it so the girl's gonna get smart with mom like well did your daughter say that he took it and my mom was like no i'm just asking because she said that he she saw him outside at that time and she was like well he didn't mention anything to me um da -da -da -da. I, don't, I don't know but i'm blown okay i had to go on ebay order me a new cell phone because I was not finna first of all my dad the smart person that he is did not have insurance on my cell phone he had insurance on his but he didn't have insurance on mine so we have a, like a family partner plan or whatever excuse me I'm being nervous you trying to multitask as us women normally do but anyway I'm just you guys come to me and let me know somebody do a response video please somebody do a response video on this how do you feel this is the question of the hour of the day of the week of the month rather how do you feel when your cell phone is lost stolen broken or it needs some sort of maintenance on it and you don't have it. I'm talking about even if you even if it's in your room and it fell behind your bed and you can't find it for 20 minutes. Or even if you can't find it for 2 hours. You know, to when you 
have lost it, or somebody has stolen it, or it's broken, falling, falling in the toilet. How do you feel? I know me, I text a lot. That's basically how I communicate, especially now that I'm living in a different area than the majority of my friends, you know. I have to text, I call, but mostly I text. And I feel lost, oh my god, I feel lost lost, lost without myself. Oh. Oh, my dad was laughing in my face. I was like, Daddy, I can't communicate with the outside world. I can't. I can't. Oh, my God. And my dad was laughing at me. He was like, well, that, I mean, isn't that good that you can't? Isn't it good that you could do it the old-fashioned way? First of all, the house phone, we don't, the house phone has been dissolved, okay? Everybody in the house uses their cell phone now. And I don't have my cell phone! Ah! Oh my god, I'm so crazy about this situation. It's making me mad as we speak right now. Just the fact that I know that somebody, and here's the kicker. The reason why I know that it's not lost in a gutter somewhere and that somebody has it is because... I was calling it and calling it and calling it. Of course, nobody answered. I mean, the phone is nice. There's a touch screen in the front, plus it has a, a slide keypad. It's a nice phone. So I was calling it and nobody answered. And then somebody called my mom's cell phone from my phone. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, that's how I know that somebody has my cell phone and somebody is a thieving hussy. Arr! Makes me so mad. Let me calm down. Let me calm down. Calm down. Don't put my stank face on. You know what I'm saying? So this that's it. Somebody took my cell phone. I'm livid about it. I want to know how you guys feel. Please, if two or three only two or three people look at this video. I don't care. I want you guys to leave me a comment. I want you guys to send me a video. Words of condolences for my dead cell phone. <laughs> please guys something like I love that cell phone it was actually a new cell phone relatively new anyway that my dad had surprised me with and I took care of that thing like nobody's business okay I had it in my protective case even though I hated that case you know so if it fell or if something were to happen then money bet it would be good but my dad cut that cell phone off so quick he was like ah nobody is not going to use this cell phone nobody is not going to run no minutes up on this cell phone but i'm just saying that's how i know somebody has it somebody called my mom's phone from my cell phone and then when we tried to call him from her phone call my cell phone back nobody answered mm -hmm. they was trying to figure out how to work the cell phone no, not return the cell phone, work the cell phone for themselves. But let me tell you, they're not going to get no free service off of us. My dad cut that phone off so quick, it would have made their head spin. And I know they was upset about that. Anyway, whew, let me woo style. Let me count to 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. The case of the stolen cell phone. I will let y'all know. When I get my new cell phone, I will do a video and let y'all know how it looks. I'm excited about it. I hope eBay doesn't let me down. It's supposed to be a new cell phone. And I only got it for 60 bucks. So, you know, I was working. Okay, I wasn't going to go on a Sprint or whatever. The Sprint online and spend like... 80 to 180 bucks on a new cell phone that wasn't half as good as mine. I got me a blue, uh, a Blackberry for 60 bucks, okay, and a bidding war. Anyway, so let me let y'all go. I'm still mad. Here's my stank face. Arr. No, I'm just joking. It's all love. Whatever happens to me, whatever, whoever took it or whatever happened to it, I mean. God's willing, I will have my new cell phone and it'll be perfect. I'll let y'all know. But whatever happens to me is going to happen to them ten times, ten times fold. So I don't have to worry about it. The Bible says, vengeance is mine, saith the Lord. So I don't have to worry about any type of revenge or anything like that. It's all under God's plan. And it was meant to happen. I guess maybe somebody needed a cell phone more than I did. But guys, I miss texting. Oh. Anyway, this is your girl, Lady T, signing out. Be blessed, be bold, be beautiful, be natural, be you. Deuce.